Hello everyone, this is Hyowa here. Today I will be reacting to the Genshin Impact behind the scenes. Uh, this is for the uh, producing the sounds of the UA. So this is um, a behind the scenes kind of footage of the Liyue Orchestra. Uh, so the people, the orchestra that produced the uh, soundtrack for the Liyue area. Um, so this is also before uh, in the West we got Hoyoverse. Um, and that it was used to be Mihoyo. I actually like this logo, Teko Taku Save the World. I actually kind of miss seeing this on my uh, play screen now. It's a game track recording session. So, Shanghai Symphony Orchestra Hall. So they were recording this at the height of the pandemic, in a sense. It kind of shows you um, how well the quarantine was done, since most of the, uh, well, all of them don't have to wear their masks, but they were also taking the precautions with the screens as well, in between. So for those who don't know, um, this would be a Gujin, uh, which basically means ancient or old um, type of piano. So Kam is technically what we can translate to a, um, a type of piano that uses strings. So a Guang Kam is usually means metal strings, and metal strings usually hit with a hammer from the pressing of the keys. Um, and in Japan, Korea, and even in some parts of Asia, they play this instrument. Uh, though in Japan, it's called kot, uh, koto, or, koto, koto, and then um, it has its own form. They all have different lengths, different number of strings. So they actually are now um, their own instruments in their own respective nations. So anyone who's interested in this instrument, um, there is an anime uh, called Kono Oto Tomare. Um, it's uh, basically about kotos and um, a bunch of students who are learning to play it and then perform in um, a concert. I would recommend it, it's quite good, it's only 24 episodes long so far, so go check it out. I love how the conductor is enjoying herself. She's got such a big smile on her face. She's enjoying this piece of music and the performance of everyone. I remember. That's a uh, peipa, an old Chinese um, form of guitar, basically, though technically not a guitar. Also, a weapon used by one of the um, four heavenly kings, uh, Satin Ball Tenor in Going to the West. I love this mix of Western orchestra with Chinese instruments, it really works. And then we have the deck. I love flutes as well. They produce such a amazing sound. That kind of reverberates.
Such a strong piece. I just love it. Just to see the the atmosphere is so much more relaxed as well. Despite being like a, a final recording, probably or just a Qingxi Village BGM. I love that village. This is one of the more scenic ones as well. The way that the fields are, you know, layered into layers, and then the color of all of the flowers and stuff. There's a guy who's just reading the music script or he's fallen asleep to the music. <laughs> this is quite an interesting orchestra hall. how the strings flow and the flute I wonder how many people who saw Mo Da Zhou Shi the Grandmasters of Cult of Demonic uh, Cultivation had gone and gotten one of these flutes because of the significance of it in the show I mean, I love Mihoyo um, for giving us all these behind the scenes, especially the music. The music in Genshin Impact is definitely one of its strongest points. It's never disappointed. Um, so it was always good to be able to see that Mihoyo understands this and they didn't go out and produce um, or provide us with all of these behind the scenes content so that we can actually see the amount of effort that's been put into it. We can see the faces of the people producing the music. And at the same time, we can even um, enjoy it on a different level. Uh, rather than just inside the game, we can now see it being performed. Um, the other thing I like about Miho is also the fact that they are releasing the OSTs on YouTube uh, and in other areas as well, where so we can actually enjoy the music without having to play the game. Uh, I don't know if they have the OSTs on sale. Um, so that I do not know. But yeah, it, the amount of music they, they, they produce um, already exceeds a lot of the soundtracks from some of the largest games and um, even longer than most movies now. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed that reaction. Uh, I hope you um, it uh, interests you to go and look for more behind the scenes um, content from uh, Genshin Impact and from Hoyo. Um, please like and subscribe uh, and have a nice day. Bye.